When I was um, little, from I guess it was most of the time in elementary school from maybe third or fourth grade, um, these boys would always come when I got onto the playground. They'd always, like when I was walking into the school, they'd come in, they'd beat, beat me up, and then they'd try to pull my dress up. And uh, I also loved to do the bars and, you know, the rings and go upside down on the monkey gym and all that stuff. So I told my mom, and she said, you should write a letter to the principal. So I wrote a letter to the principal saying it was unconstitutional because in my school at that time, girls had to only wear dresses. They only could wear dresses. So I said to the principal, you know, it's unconstitutional that girls can only wear dresses. And then I told him how, you know, when I'm on the monkey bars, the boys were hanging around and, you know, not being cool and that I was getting, you know, bullied a lot and beaten up. And so I said it was not constitutional and that girls should be allowed to wear pants. So he called me into this office and he said, you know, I read your, I read your thing and, you know, you have a point. And, you know, if you're going to be upside down, you don't want to be wearing a dress. And I said, yeah. And he said, well, how about we try it for a year? On Fridays, you can wear pants. So every Friday, he said, nobody else, just you. So every Friday, I wore pants and went on the rings and went upside down on the monkey bars for as long as I could because I loved it. And then those boys that were beating me up and trying to pull my dress dress up, they couldn't do it with the pants. So it was very good. And then after the year, he said, okay, everybody can wear pants or dresses. I liked wearing dresses. It's just that, you know, you don't want to have dresses on when you're upside down too much, right? (laughs) Especially, you know, when you're young like that, it's scary. Anyway, it worked out, and that's like that's one of the things that made me fall in love with the Constitution of the United States and with the Bill of Rights, even though what I was asking him was not actually unconstitutional. Just the fact that there was a Constitution, that I could say that, even though I didn't understand it, it was so good for me. So <laughs> I love that we have a Constitution, and I love that we have a Bill of Rights, and I would really appreciate it if whoever is in office— honors that. It's important.